Hi, Grey Gators, Mrs. Collins. It's Thursday, almost the end of another week, finishing up our first week of phase two learning at home. I have a book for you today that's kind of topical. It is called How Did Dinosaurs Get Well Soon? It's by Jane Yolen and Mark Teague. And um, perhaps you're familiar with this story. It's topical because some people are sick right now, as I think you know, which is why we can't go to school. So let's hear about the dinosaurs and how they get well soon. He is not looking good. <clears throat> what if a dinosaur catches the flu? Does he whimper and whine in between each Achoo! Does he drop dirty tissues all over the floor? Does he fling all his medicine out of the door? Does he flip off his covers with tooth and with tail? Does he dump out his juice and get sick in a pail? Does a dinosaur whale? What if a dinosaur goes to the dock? Does he drag all his feet till his mom is in shock? <clears throat> Does he hold his mouth closed when he's told open wide? Does he scream? Is he mean? Does he run off and hide? Yeah, you can barely see him behind that book. <clears throat> Does he push back each drink? Spit his pills in the sink? Does he make a big stink? Is that what you think? No. He drinks lots of juice and he gets lots of rest. He's good at the doctors because doctors know best. He uses a hanky on mouth and on nose. He snuggles right down underneath the bed clothes. He takes all his medicine without a fight. He closes his eyes. He whispers, good night. Then mama and papa tiptoe out the door. Get well, get well, little dinosaur. And that is the end of How Do Dinosaurs Get Well Soon? I hope you've been well, Gators, and I hope everyone in your family is well too. I hope you're still washing those hands and covering your sneezes and covering your coughs and staying indoors and being safe. I miss you. Bye.